tights around your neck and they fit perfectly, then they'll fit good. This looks stupid as shit. <laughs> Cause I'm right now I can't tell. Like I said, this flimsy ass. This supposed to be like a sock shoe, y'all. This don't give diaper booty. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh, oh. yeah, yeah. Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to the channel. It's your Sarah Renee. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Join the fam. And if you're new, make sure you turn on push notifications so you never miss a video from me. If you're new and you don't know, I post Sundays and Wednesdays at noon, 12 p.m. So make sure you are here right on time so you can get all the content, okay? Today I am tapping into my fashion bag. Um, I'm going to do a style with me. Featuring Shein. This is not a sponsored video at all, but let us pray for one and manifest that one's coming in the future. Um, one thing about me, I've always been like scared to do this kind of content on my channel just because when it comes to fashion and like my fashion sense, I feel like I am very safe and I play it safe all the time and I don't. You know, like, girl, I'm a brand new truths, boring kind of girl, and I'm trying to, like, get into color and just get out of my comfort zone. So, without further ado, let's jump into today's video. All right, so basically how I'm going to do today's video is I'm going to show you guys the item that I got from Shein. Um, I'm going to try to put all the links in the description box below for y'all so you'll know the price, the sizing, etc. okay? So, first things first, I got these cargos. Um, nine times out of ten, everything that I got uh, from Shein today is going to be in a medium. Um, I don't try to get anything from petite and I don't try to get anything from small, I mean from tall because I feel like I'm like in the middle. I'm a regular size girl. So, yeah. First things first are these cargos from, from what I'm looking at. They might be too big. I don't know. And you know what somebody said? If you put your pants around your neck and they fit perfectly, then they'll fit good. They they get around my neck okay. So maybe they'll be maybe they'll be the right size. I don't know. But we're gonna try to style these. Okay. Okay, so if I look crazy, it's because I'm filming on my camera right here in front of me. But I'm also filming over here on my phone so you guys can get the full fit because this camera set up right here is not going to show you me from head to toe, all right? So, the cargos are it. So, basically, I paired these pants with a shirt that I got from Forever 21. Yes, girl, I know. Last time I checked, I thought Forever 21 was going out of business. But this is from the men's section. But the back is cute, and the back is what sold me on the shirt. Now, you see the green? Yes, ma'am. So, I got these shades from Shein as well so I might as well put these on so we can pair them with the cargos cuz you always need to accessorize honey oh my god okay wait these turn everything green these got tint to them they're cute okay it's giving so let's talk about the fit of the cargos they fit me pretty well like let's talk about it it's not much room right here there is a bit of room in the back i don't know if y'all can tell you know that back gap you know now in the crotch area they are kind of tight and i'm not sure if that's because i got these sumo wrestler ass thighs they come all the way down on me and then i paired them with these sneaks they're like gray, orange, and green. If my camera will focus, feel me. They're dirty, so please don't talk about me. But, um, yeah. Because these cargos are like, they give me a washed green. So, I like that I played off of the green color. All the pockets are real. Love that for me. My damn thighs are so big, I could barely even get my hands in the pockets. But, um, and in terms of the back, y'all can always get that tailor, you know? I don't know, I'm turning into a real fashion girl when I start to get things tailored. But I like them. They're really good quality. That's one thing I can say. They are really, really good quality. So, I rate the shades a 10. I rate the pants a 9.5. Just because, I don't know if it's because I'm wearing a thong or it's because the crotch area is a little bit 
tight. But other than that, they fine. Okay. So next up, you guys, we have this pink beanie because it's fall. We're going into winter. Definitely need something to cover my ears. And then I have this black jumpsuit. Off rip, I'm scared because these these arms look little. Like these arms look short. And my body, and when it comes to my body, like proportionately, I'm weird. I have a short torso and really long legs. Like, I know it probably don't look like you're from the cut of the angle right now. But we're going to see how this goes. I want this look to give real cozy, real warm vibes. So we're going to sit. Hold on, because let me talk. Let me stop. <laughs> Hold on, because let me stop talking about she and like, let me stop judging the blue glass cover. Because, baby, the way this body suit is fitting on me right now, I know that's right. Because that was happening. The arms long enough for sure and i do think this is tall girl friendly because the i had to like scrunch up the bottom of the pants leg it's so it's so it's like it make you want like rub on yourself <laughs> this is nice and i'm sorry if it's is it sheer y'all Hold on, y'all can't see my head is this sheer i hope it's not sheer because like i'm stuck in between underneath but I love the low cut. Now, this is not good for winter, honestly, truly, but I like this. I need to get this in every single color. Run. Right now, run and get it. I would say get your size. Don't go up and don't go down because it's stretchy, but it also has, like, grip. I have put on some, um, I've worn some jumpsuits before. And they gave me like darker booty. Like, this don't give darker booty. I like it. I like it. Okay, so like I said, I want this to give real cozy vibes. And I am not one to wear beans a lot. But like I said earlier, I'm trying to get out of my comfort zone. And I just think, I think an all black fit with a pop of color would look so cute. So right now I have on some waterproof Uggs, okay? Because, you know, black on black with a pop of pink, I think that would look so cute. This looks stupid as shit. Because <laughs> right now I can't tell. My hands are like big. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, so I got this jacket from ASOS a couple of years ago, and it's like versatile. It got the shiny inside or outside, and then like the regular inside or outside, because you can wear it either way. Um, now, one thing about this that blew me was the string part. We, we just want to touch that inside the inside pocket, because this camera is washing me out right now so bad, and I really don't appreciate it. I wonder if there's some money in these pockets, cause you know, girl of receipts. Anyways, I think I'm like, I think I like the beanie, y'all. Right now, I'm not sure I put it all the way on my forehead because I got on makeup and I just don't want makeup to get on the head. But I think this is cute. What y'all think? The all black with the pop of color is fire. Now, somebody need to slap the shit out of me because I haven't even put no jewelry on. I didn't even put on no jewelry with her last outfit. Are you dumb? Ugh. I wear jewelry every single day. I don't care if I'm going to the grocery store. I don't care if I'm going to the gas station. I put on jewelry every single day. Why wouldn't I do it in this video? That's just me. I think this would look really, really cute with some silver jewelry. And I ended up picking up some silver jewelry from Shein. So I got these like weird looking earrings let me show y'all they're supposed to be like abstract <laughs> abstract or whatever they're different i just think that's cute let's see what they look like on the ear and my sideburns and this pimple is just going crazy right now i should have put this on the other side but the earrings are cute the earrings are vibe i ain't gonna count to y'all already opened the rings and i hate them so if anybody wants these i will ship them to you for free first off they're real cheap they cheap filling I wish I had my nails done, but I go to the nail salon tomorrow. They're cheap feeling and they're too big for me. Like, 
it could it could fit my thumb if I'm careful. Like I better not do no activities that day. But like it's it's barely staying. It's real loose booty. I like my rings to like fit really really well. Like see this one won't even stay on. But good thing I have my own jewelry. I'll probably wear this thick ass ring that I got and then this bracelet that I got from Megama. Probably like some simple studs. These are not studs. Probably some simple hoops. So next up I got this Chicago hoodie. Now hear me out. I thought this was going to be way more oversized. Before I picked it up. Um, so let me tell y'all how I thought I was going to style it. So I wanted to make it look like a little grown and sexy. I thought it was going to be super oversized. I was going to wear it with some silver jewelry and I was going to pair it with these boots that I got from Forever 21. Yeah, Forever 21 did they the fizzle with these because they come all the way up to like all the way up my thigh and they fit really, really good and they're really really comfortable one thing about me i love big stuff unless it's supposed to be fitted i love all my clothes to be big i don't know why i'm like that what the bro this is fitting so regular right now so maybe instead of wearing them with the boots i could possibly pair them with these ducks that i haven't worn yet just because it's green in here somewhere oh yeah it's green right here so i don't know can't even see them. I don't like it. I don't like nothing about it. To be honest. I tried to put them on with the dunks and it's not giving just because this wasn't the vision that I wanted. I look like a teacher on Fridays, like when I dress down. That's what it's giving. And I don't like it. So yeah, I'm not even sure if the website was just misleading or I just didn't read. I don't know if this is supposed to be oversized or not, but I would definitely say go oversized because um even with the even with the sleeves right now, I thought this was the sleeve, and it's not. This is the jumpsuit. So the sleeves are, like, right at my wrist. And I don't like that. I like everything to be big because after you wash it and dry it one time, it, sh it shrinks. Like, this is definitely going to be something that I don't um, dry. It's nice quality, and it's thick. I like that. I like that it doesn't look cheap either. Like sometimes people have printed hoodies and sweatshirts that end up looking cheap. But it's definitely giving teacher dress down day. So, um, next thing I guess is this body shoot. It's brown. I just wanted to see if she had, had anything on their website that was similar to scams. I was trying to see if I can get a dupe because we all know scams is very, very expensive. I have no idea how I'm going to style this because I just got it because I needed a shirt. <laughs> so I'm basically just going to put this on to tell you guys about the fit. Okay, you guys. So the fit of the shirt is really nice. It's really soft. The arms are nice and long, and it's stretchy, but I will go up the size because I know y'all can probably see my motherfucking fat rolls right now. And yes, I have on some pants from Pretty Little Thing that I've never worn, and I was just trying to see if my work in the gym was paying off, and I still cannot button them all the way. But y'all know how some of the fashion girls be wearing their pants like unzipped. Um... I think that looks really cute when you do it and your thumb peeking out. But yeah, don't try to sound out. And then I also got these glasses. And I absolutely love them. This is a closure, so let me be careful when I'm showing y'all. I love how thick they are on the side. These are super duper cute. And the glasses are like dirt cheap. I'm not sure if this will look cute with a beanie or not. But I just wanted to put on the cream one. Now hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Spice it up with some gold jewelry. Don't mind me with the pants, but I also got these boots. <gasps> you kind of see where I'm going? Like these boots because the cream and the black with the cream and the, I feel like they will pop out. I feel like they will pop out. <laughs> now I also got these boots. The real chunky heel. You feel the vibes? It's chunky and it's like a little platform. Real cute, real cute. Now I already put the boots on. Because I was geeked. And then go last to you. 
And I was real upset because first off, you can see like it looks like it's giving it's giving super glue. It's giving it's giving hot gun glue. That's what it's giving. Like you see that all around that like shininess. Yeah, that gives me hot glue gun. And then the part that's supposed to be tight on your ankle right here is loose booty. I don't know if it's because the bottom of my legs give chicken bone. You know how a drumstick be fat at the top and then a little e -t 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 at the bottom. That's what my legs kind of give. I'm going to change my pants and I'll be back. The beanie immediately gives me comfy cozy vibes. So I just paired the brown top with some brown um, sweatpants. These are from Zara. If you're anything like me and you like big stuff, go up. Two sizes with the Zara sweatpants because one thing they do make sure to do for you is give you that nice elastic band around your waist to snatch you up. But baby, I can't even show y'all my ankles right now because they is giving high borders. And I could pair it with with this like flannel jacket that I have. You see how cute that is? Cause it got cream. And did the, ah! Yeah, that's cute. You know, this is a this is a moment. I feel like this is a moment. I feel like this is cute, but at this point, I'm gonna be pairing it with some slippers because the ankles is is biting. My ankles cold and shit right now. But yeah, love this. I would say the quality of this shirt is really good, and I know that's what y'all are here for, because when it comes to Shein, the prices are dirt cheap. I don't know, they used to be dirt cheap, little, they used to be dirt cheap, but now they're trying to, like, up the price a little bit. But the quality is really nice, besides the motherfucking shoes with the hot glue gun situation. Other than that, the quality is pretty darn nice. And then, last but not least, I know I already, like, gave y'all a sneak peek of these boots, but this exact outfit, minus the sweatpants, and probably with some, like, like wash jeans, would probably really, really eat with these. These would be cute, but let's see. I got a seven, and I would suggest going up a half size if you can. Yeah, this is a dinner date shoe, dinner date boot, because they hurt. And I just don't even want to style these anymore because, like I said, this flimsy ass ankle. This is supposed to be like a sock shoe, y'all. And there's no elasticity. Like, I don't know if somebody wore these and returned them or what. I got a 37. I think that's a 7 as well, but I don't even know. The shape of the, of the boot is so fucking cute. But it don't fit me right here. So I'm kind of upset about that. But anyways, I think that's all I got from Shein. Um, make sure you follow me on Instagram to see exactly how I style these when I go out on this town. And I take some flicks. But yeah, if y'all like these type of videos, be sure to like and tell me in the comments. Because I will film them over and over and over again for y'all. Thank y'all so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, mamas. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh.